Welcome everybody. I got a head start on you. I already did some of this. <laughs> this is Duralar paper. Did I say that right? Duralar. And it's a graphic paper and it's a very good deal. It's like 25 sheets in there. Uh, I also have UPO paper, but it's a little more, you know, pricey. So I'm doing the Duralar. And what I thought about doing was just kind of what we might could do in um, fluid art. Um, they, you know, doing a swipe, they lay their paints down, and, you know, we, anyway, that's how I come up with doing this little line, blowing this away and blowing that away, uh, with my super duper air maker, <laughs> my compressor, it is awesome, it's because it's my husband's, and you don't have to hear any noise in the background, um, like all the other ones are. Because I looked at quite a few of them before deciding which one I was wanting to use. So, that's a story on that. And I'm going to move some things out of the way. And put some things. Let me get myself organized. Hold on. Now, this is completely new to me. I have not done this method. So, Let's hope it uh, turns out good, right? Oh, looks like alcohol is needed. I recommend one of these Lazy Susans to do this because it's fun moving it. It's much easier for me to do it this way because the other way I was twisting my fingers every which way. <laughs> Looking silly. And see that gives me a lot more control. There we go. That's pretty. Oh yeah, this is so much easier. I was doing it the hard way. Without the lazy season. Oh my goodness, what a difference. A little bit of pink in there. Oh, there you go. Why don't we just splatter it everywhere? Oh, well, that was kind of cool, though. <laughs> 
it made some interest in it. I'm just softening the edges. I'm trying to create something. I don't know what I'm creating, but it's something. <laughs> now I'm losing my purple, so I'm coming in with some purple. Thing right up here on my rolling. <laughs> that wasn't any good, was it? No. Thought I had alcohol in my hand, but I didn't. more hands. This is when I wish I was an octopus. In fact, that's funny I said that because I actually was thinking about doing an octopus. Looks like a mushroom right there. That's pretty. Look at my arms. I need to loosen up here. Oh, shoulders are a little tense. I don't know why. I guess whenever you do something new, like this is a new pattern, I usually draw something, but... Pretty. Oh, I love it. I really do. That is amazing. So pretty. I need some to come up the page. So I'm gonna do that. Now this air is really powerful. So 
you'll see me try to control myself from blasting it, you know? <laughs> I don't want to blast you. Like that. Yeah, that's cool. See, just wanted to show you what it looks like. Pretty cool, right? Now, if you've made a mistake, let's say, and you want to move that back, all you do is add a little some alcohol. And as you see, it softened my edges and also brought them down to here. Well, I don't know what my deal is. Just working away, not chatting. Sorry about that. <laughs> I'm concentrating. And yeah, I concentrate when I paint. I don't know about anybody else, but if I start a chit chatting, something will go wrong. See, the alcohol will bring it right back to the center if you're not wanting any sping uh, spiders or spinglies or something like that. I can't remember what they call them. I just know what they look like. So pretty. Wow. All right. There we go. Now I'm going to, as usual, take a thunk for a minute and see what else needs to be done. I'm thunking right now, thinking. <laughs> okay. I think it's all done. I'll give you a flyover. I do have it on my Lazy Susan, so you're not really that far from the camera. Um, but you got to see what uh, the uh, air compressor does. Now, they s sell a very small one, but it's very noisy, and it stays on all the time. Then you can get another size up, about like that, and it makes noise the entire time that you're making it. What I have is the big dog, <laughs> my husband's, and it don't, it, all you do is just turn it on, put it to the compression that you need, I think that's the right word, I don't know, <laughs> but you just fill it up, and then when it's out, it will just stop blowing air, and then uh, you can go over there and turn it on again, and it'll fill back up, and then you're off and running again, without the sound of the terrible... Uh, air gun or air compressor sound. There we go. Okay, we're going to leave this baby right here. And and sign it. 
It's not the best signature ever, but <laughs> there we go. I sure think it's pretty. I do know that. Let me see if I can give you a flyover. Here's our flyover. Using a line across the paper with just two colors. I used purple and I used deep pink. Getting a little bit closer there for you. And it, I kind of thought of it like a swipe or a bloom. They do blooms, you know, they layer each color and then blow it out with a cell activator. The fluid art way. Well, I used alcohol inks in that way by putting the pink and the purple together and making a line. And then with the air compressor, I blew in different directions. So, I think that turned out pretty good for the first time doing it. Thank you for joining me. If you're liking my channel, give me a thumbs up. Um, comments are always welcome. Tell me some things that you'd like me to see, to do, and what you'd like to see. <laughs> thumbs up if you liked it. Um, comments are always welcomed. Uh, the algorithm of Google, you know. Um, and most importantly, it rely, it really comes down to you guys. If you guys like me, uh, then uh, you'll subscribe. And I'll keep trying to do something right to keep building on my channel. All right, you guys. You Until the next one. Bye.